Good news, it's Python on hardware time. Yay, Blinka. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff going on in the world of Python. Okay. Well, we hit a milestone. Yeah. 300 CircuitPython libraries. From Adafruit, we also have you know, almost 100 from the community and the community bundle. But Adafruit, us, we, um, yeah. whenever we do a breakout board, Unless there's some really weird reason, we always do a uh, library for it. Uh, sometimes there's stuff under NDA or there's a pre-compiled binary we can't. But pretty much 99% of our breakout boards and uh, dev boards and sensors and helpers and libraries and stuff um, are part of the Adafruit CircuitPython libraries. Here's the good news. Every CircuitPython library we write um, is supported and also works in C Python, which means it works on a Raspberry Pi. It works on a computer with a, a USB GPIO converter, like an FT232. If you, if you learn Python once, you can use it in all these places. That's yeah. kind of the cool thing. The write once, run anywhere thing is actually possible now. With Python. Also, um, these libraries work on MicroPython if you use the Blinka library. Yep. So we hit 300. Uh, thanks so much for everyone who helps. You know, all of these have documentation and typing data and read the docs and example codes. And it's just been awesome. Um, you know, one of the best decisions I made was let's have one library that works for CircuitPython and, you know, Python boards as well, because, you know, people love to use our sensors with single board computers like BeagleBone, Raspberry Pi, yeah. as well as microcontrollers. Write once, run everywhere. Yeah, and if you want to support Adafruit and all of the folks that we pay to write all these libraries and more, uh, pick up an electronic kit. Pick up a breakup board. Yep. Something at adafruit.com and use the discount code tonight. Um, other news uh, we wanted to get out there, speaking of supporting others, GitHub Sponsors now has uh, more countries, so if you want to sponsor someone in another country, you can. Uh, Circuit Python Day is coming up pretty soon. Two weeks. It is Friday, August 19th. We have a lot going on. We have a panel discussion. We've got chat with some of the core team. We have a special edition of a CircuitPython themed show and tell. We have a project build. There's a lot of stuff going on. Um, Foamy Guy is doing a CircuitPython Day uh, game jam stream. Oh, yeah. And then um, the thing that we're going to show off, um, and then we have a ton of other things going on in the newsletter and the world of Python on hardware. Lots of Unending Picos, projects and games, things videos, that you can make. But MicroPython. What, but I thought what we would do this week is um, show what came in the mail here. Oh, that's right. So, so this is from. Why don't you hold this up, and then I'll get this all yeah. cleared off and ready. So this is. What the, could it be? I well, wonder what it is. This is actually a real unboxing. Um, so thank you, Kevin, who sent this along. These are the hack tablets. Okay, so um, here's a. Oh, you have. One. You may have seen the um, show and tell in the past, where Kevin came on, and Tim's show. Um, Tim also went over this and said we're giving these away. And the, the way we're giving these away is um, Kevin sent this to us, and um, we're going to take care of all the shipping and everything. So uh, here it is. Adafruit team encloses five quantity of the hack tablets in support of the CircuitPython Day giveaway coordinated with Tim Fomiga. Thank you for your support on this hack. Key match. So okay. here, put that on the overhead. See? Look at this. Mm -hmm. I didn't know what was going to be in this box. Like, it could have been anything. could have been, like, squirrels. Um, and nice. then uh, here's the uh, hack tablets. All right, so let's show, let's show one off. And I can, uh, yeah, why don't you open up one? Um, okay. You can use the. Uh, okay, let's put it. Yeah, go yeah. to the overhead, and I'll, uh, I'll I'll carefully open one up. Yeah, you ready? Yep. Okay. Hit let's me. Uh, do it. Okay, so take off my rubber band, and then I'll just carefully open. Will we wrap this when complete? Okay, so this is uses a Creston display and enclosure, and then we'll unwrap this. Okay, ooh. Okay, so this got a um, ESP32 S3 NR8, R8, N8, R8, which means it's got eight megabytes of flash, eight megabytes of PS RAM, and it needs that because uh, this is plugged in and controls a uh, seven inch capacitive touch display there's also okay there's ooh, there's a little thing welcome to hack tablet this is using circuit python uh we're going to they're going to try to get into the main branch uh k match signed it this is uh genuine um, yeah it's in color and then maybe i can just quickly plug it in i don't know if it's going to work but you know what i'm gonna 
risk it. I guess the only question is I don't know how to, I'm learning too, but maybe I can just plug it into here. I don't know. You think maybe? I didn't? I didn't expect that we would be powering it up though. That's yeah, the only thing I, I don't know. either. So I'm sorry if I, if I do something wrong. Well, it lit up. Something's okay. happening. Something's happening. Oh. <gasps> oh. Whoa. Look at that. <laughs> As you can tell, we completely didn't plan this. Look at this. This is great. So this is someone. So, cool. so someone is definitely going to get one of these for sure. Yeah, I don't think the touch screen does any. Oh, it oh, does. Yeah, it yeah, follow. I can. I can. Whoa, that's kind of fun. Yeah, isn't that cool? All right. Yeah, this is this is super fun. So, do you want one of these? Yes. Yeah. And you can get it for free, Circuit, right? Circuit Python Day is when we'll be giving these away. Ooh. So. Uh, Amazing. That's what you want, Circuit Python Day. Okay. All right. Thank you so much, K Match and Foamy Guy, for getting the word out on these. And uh, thank you to the Circuit Python community that's making all this possible together. And that is this week's Python on Hardware. Don't forget, you can get this newsletter delivered every single week to your inbox. You can also look at it on the website if you don't want to do that. And uh, it's at Adafruit Daily. We made a completely separate site because we don't want anything connected to your store account because we don't like spam either. We don't spam you anywhere. But this made it super duper clear. This is completely separate just for, for newsletters. OK, I got to put this carefully back into That's right. this bag. Um, that out of the box demo with the hack tablet was better than like my first iPod. <laughs> yeah. My first iPod didn't work out of the box. Okay. Good work, Okay.